Hi guys! Today I'm going to talk to you about hair. It's been three months since I started the Curly Girl Method and I am loving it. And my inspiration is the Curly Girl Handbook by Lorraine Massey. And this is her right there. And I had the pleasure of meeting her when I went to Diva Shawn Salon last week. And I took a picture with her. And I must say, my experience at Diva Shawn Salon was amazing. I would never forget. I took tons of pictures. Um, they sure taught me a lot about hair, curly hair that is, because I'm doing all natural. And this is it. So far, this is three months of being into it. And my hair has been at its moisturizing best because I used to suffer from dry hair before and I hated it. I'm going to show you some products that I use ever since I started the Curly Girl Method and a lot of them are all 100% all natural organic products and it's really awesome because none of them are processed or have any type of chemicals added to it. So hopefully after you see this video, it would inspire you because Lorraine Massey is my curly girl inspiration. So here we go. This right here is the Diva Curl No Poo, which is, this is the pretty much the cleanser. And No Poo pretty much is like no shampoo, which means there's no harsh chemicals in it. Um, no harmful detergents that are in that are in regular shampoos. There's no silicone. There's no parabens and big no-nos to a bunch of any type of chemicals. So I use that to cleanse my hair, and you can tell the difference between the no poo and a regular shampoo because a regular shampoo. Anytime I was done washing my hair before, my hair would feel kind of like dry and rubbery like like a rubber band um, hopefully you guys understand what I mean but the no poo your hair feels like it's been conditioned it feels a lot softer it even looks a lot shinier and my hair is not as tangly as it used to be when I used to wash with regular shampoos so next I use in my hair is the Diva Curl one conditioner which is an awesome conditioner. You could use it daily. You could use it as a deep conditioner. Whatever you want to do with it. And let me tell you, it smells awesome. And my curls are soft. My curls are luxurious. They're shiny. I love the one conditioner. Diva Curl definitely has a lot of products that I will continue to keep on using and I hope that you will be inspired of the Diva Curl as well as as I have been inspired. The next of Diva Curl I use is Heaven in Here. This is what it looks like and this is what it's called. Heaven in Here. And again, it has no parabens, 100% sulfate and silicone free. This is awesome for a deep conditioner. After you finish using your no poo, you can use this and deep condition inside your hair for as long as you want. Usually when I'm at home and I'm doing it, I'll deep condition for, I'll go watch a movie or something and leave it on the whole time. Or sometimes I'll overnight condition it, like after I finish wash, washing or cleansing my hair, I'll put in the heaven and hair and... After I soak it all in, I take it into different sections and I make sure each one, each one, each strand has it in there. And when I'm done, I just simply put on a plastic cap and then over that plastic cap, I would use my microfiber towel to tie it up afterwards. Um, also, another thing that I like to use as a deep conditioner sometimes is by Shea Moisture Anti-Breakage Mask. And this deep conditioner is awesome. It is totally awesome. Heaven and Hair and this anti-breakage mask are two of my favorite deep conditioners in the whole wide world. Nothing can change my mind about them. After one use of both of them, 
my hair was totally changed. It was different. It was wonderful. It was beautiful. I never felt so confident about my hair until I've learned to accept my curls. And also which I learned how to control my curls and how to maintain them and tame them and how to keep them healthy. Because before I had no idea what I was doing. Another thing I like to use in my hair as a deep condition that I do sometimes is raw honey. Now, this is not like regular honey that you buy at a regular grocery store. Um, this is definitely pretty different or whatever. This um, is pure, unpasteurized, unfiltered. Um, it has alive enzymes, and enzymes are good for your hair. Vitamins, minerals, and all the nutrients are carefully preserved as a whole food. Fresh and straight from the hive. How wonderful is that? So this is unprocessed, it's, it has natural antioxidants and beneficial factors. Um, so that's a good thing. This is good. You don't, this, is, this works better than regular honey that you buy from the grocery store. Because I used to use the regular honey from the grocery store before I realized that they had a type of honey like this. Where this is all natural, organic-y and stuff. And it's a big difference because this definitely gives your hair all the nutrients that weren't taken away like the one in the grocery store. Um, I also would mix the raw honey and I'll mix it with the almond oil. 100% pure almond oil. And this is organic. It doesn't have tons of ingredients to go in it that are harmful for your hair. And the good thing about this too is you can use this on your body as a moisturizer, as a lotion. I sometimes use it on my face after I finish cleansing my face. So, Or sometimes I use it as an oil just to put in my hair for whatever day I feel like putting it in my hair. But I like to also mix it into the honey for a deep conditioner. And I'll throw in some extra virgin olive oil, which is awesome and great for your hair. It restores nutrients and it's perfect for dry ends and it's good. It helps with dandruff. So I mix those three together and I make a conditioner. And, and sometimes I'll sit there and add another oil to that deep conditioner. And I can also use olive oil, extra virgin olive oil for our regular oil just by itself as well. Just to give my hair a shine. Or... I can add this into the deep conditioner too, coconut oil, pressed, fresh pressed virgin. So this is not just a regular coconut oil that you buy in a beauty supply store. This is pretty much organic and this is by Dr. Bronner's. I love Dr. Bronner's products. I really, really do. And I can use this in my hair by itself and it has an awesome smell. And this works really good for your hair. It moisturizes. It keeps it from being dry. And one thing about organic products that they do that other beauty products for your hair claim to do is that a lot of products in the beauty supply store or anywhere you can buy beauty products for your hair, they claim to dry to not dry out your hair and to help with the dry ends and to help with this and to help with that. But a lot of those are water-based. So when you put it on, it looks like it's doing something for your hair. But then when it dries, guess what? Your hair is back to normal again, all dry and frizzy and everything like that. So these actually penetrate into your hair, and it stays there. Another thing that's awesome and awesome for your hair is an oil, too, or you can add into your deep conditioner, DYI, is Jehovah Oil. And this is all natural, organic, and everything as well. Nothing processed, nothing added into it. It's really, really good. And sometimes I also use the Jehovah oil before I go cleansing my hair. I massage my scalp with it to loosen up any dirt or any buildup in my scalp to help just loosen it up some, and then I go cleanse my hair. Now, I know many of you heard of uh, Morocco Organ Oil, and this is the one that I've been using. And I can't complain about it. It's pretty good. Um, I mainly use the argan oil for any split ends and for any dry ends at the end of my hair because argan oil really, really helps with split ends and dry ends. It works miracles. It's amazing. I love it. I really do. 
And this bottle, it used to have something else in it, but um, I took off the tag. And what I did, I kept it because you see the top here? It's uh, You turn it to open it, and you turn it to close it. And I like this bottle because I use it for whenever I want to give myself a scalp treatment. I mix inside of here my DIY oil. And inside here, what I have right now, I put extra virgin olive oil, 100% pure moisturizing almond oil, my organic coconut oil, and my Jehovah oil. And I did add in probably a little bit of argan oil, just cause. And all of it together, I made a scalp oil treatment for myself. And it works really, really good. It helps my scalp to stay moisturized. I get it to penetrate into my scalp follicles. And it gives my hair a very beautiful shine, keeps my hair from being dried out, especially in the winter time. You know, your hair dries out more in the winter time from all the coldness and everything. So you got to keep your hair moisturized. And a lot of times what I do too, because not every day your curls are going to look super fresh. So sometimes you do need something to wake your hair up. So remember, your hair is like a plant. And what do you do with plants every day? You have to water it. So what I do, I have my spray bottle, and inside of here, I'll put about up to here with conditioner. I can use like, what I put, what I have in here right now is my one conditioner, and I'll fill it up up to here, and then the rest, I add water, and then I shake it up, like so, and then every day, I just spritz my hair, pretty much spray, 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 spray. And then I crunch, 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 crunch. And then I have myself awakened hair. <laughs> so sometimes when I need um, extra cleansing in my hair, I'll pull out my Dr. Bronner's Pure Castle Soap. And it's 18-in-1 Hemp Lavender. Like I said, Dr. Bronner's, I love his products. And it cleanses really well. And it, this is also not like other shampoos that dry out your hair or make your hair feel rubbery. This actually, on my first use of using this, I was amazed. And it does not, it does not dry my hair. Like my hair actually felt soft after one use of this. It felt really soft and I was really surprised. So this is this bottle that I have is actually the little travel size one. It's small and stuff because I didn't want to waste too much money on buying something that I might not like. So this once this bottle is finished, see, not finished yet, um, I will buy the big one. So this is an awesome hair cleanser. And you can also use it for your body. Sometimes I use it to cleanse my body as well or to clean my face. Um, when I need extra cleansing. And I really like this. I take it twice a day. I take one in the morning and I take one at night. And they're soft gels. So it's much easier to swallow and they're very small. I'll show you. Look how small that is. It's very small. So it's very easy to swallow because I don't like swallowing pills, especially horse pills. I do have trouble swallowing it. And... These are small, they're soft gels, I can't complain. I cannot complain. So this is really good if you got, they got a five star for me. So if you want to check out more reviews on it, you could go on Amazon.com. And when you look this up, just look at the reviews of what other customers have to say about it. Um, but I love these. So I hope all my products will help you. And just remember... Get the Curly Girl Handbook by Lorraine Massey. She is one totally awesome lady. And this book helps you. It will save your life. And it will make you appreciate your curls. So until next time, see ya. Love ya.